just what is network marketing all about? You know, there's a lot of misconceptions. Maybe you're new. Maybe you're trying to get a, a grasp of this. Maybe you want to tell your prospects. You know, maybe just, just for information sake, you're like, well, what actually is this about? So I've been here for 10 years in this industry, multiple companies, worked with thousands and thousands of network marketers. So I'm in a good position to, to give you some input on this uh, question. So what I would say is, first of all, is we need to accept that, you know, network marketing is a, it's a human being based business model, right? There's human beings involved. So with anything that involves human beings, there are amazing human beings and there are terrible human beings. So whatever you look for in network marketing, you're going to be able to find examples of that, especially with social media and information that's so freely available out there. If you go look for scam claims, bad companies, bad people, you're going to find plenty of that. If you go look for good companies, people that create a success, people that do things in an ethical way, you're going to find that. So whatever the most frequent information you're finding is out there, that should give you a indication of your kind of mindset so that maybe, just maybe you hold your hand up and you say, you know what, I need to try a little bit harder to be more balanced. You know what I mean? In my approach and what I'm searching for. Because if you're typing in network marketing scam, you're not going to find pro network marketing information, are you? It just doesn't make sense. So that's the first thing. Start to hold your hand up and say, well, okay, what am I actually searching for? Am I being balanced in my view? Second of all, you know, network marketing is very simple in its essence. It's just a business model where the advertising costs that are being saved by having people use word of mouth instead of billboards and TV and radio is being distributed between those people that are raking recommendations as opposed to paying the, the advertisers. That's pretty much the only difference. You know, Walmart could be a network marketing company if it wanted to. It's just a business structure. You know, Walmart could suddenly say, you know, I'm just picking a huge company, right? They could just suddenly turn around and say, you know what? We don't want to pay our staff a, a certain fixed wage. We're actually going to scrap any wages whatsoever. Your wage is zero, but anybody, we're going to give you a code number and anybody that comes in and shops with that code number, we're going to give you a percentage of the profits that we make from, their, from what they spend in our store. And also, if they then recommend friends, you know, what we'll do is we'll give them a percentage, we'll give you a small secondary percentage as well. So now you're making money off all the recommendations you make and you've got another level of recommendations that those people are making too because you were the one that made that first introduction. So multi-level marketing, you're paid off of multiple levels. That's it. If a business suddenly decided to move away from the wage model to the uh, referral model, that's all the differences in a network marketing company. The company owners said, you know what? I don't want to pay a bunch of staff right from the start. I don't want to put out advertising on TV, radio, magazines and wonder if it's going to work or not. Instead, I'd rather get a group of people together, let them sell my product or service on, on their behalf. I'll give them some education how to do that well. And because they're putting in a bit of effort here, I'm willing to pay them for those referrals because I would have never made those sales without those people. That, that's network marketing. That's what it's all about. Now, what has it become? Unfortunately, it's become polarized. We have people who, you know, again, it involves human beings. They're desperate to make some results. They don't care about the trail of destruction they leave behind them. So they'll say almost anything to get someone in the company. Oh, yeah, it's easy. It's quick money. It's big money. It's fast money. Only a small minority make big, fast money, right? The majority, it's like anything worthwhile. It takes work. It takes strategy. It takes consistency. It takes failed attempts and making adjustments and going again. If you wanted to achieve all the amazing things that network marketing can provide for you, we have to make some sacrifice. You're going to have to sacrifice some Netflix or some time from somewhere else to put some time in. You're going to have to sacrifice that people may temporarily look down on you while you build the results to go back and say, well, hey, I told you I would do this. You're going to have to temporarily face a lack of, you know, self-confidence when you try something new and put yourself out there, okay? There's a, there's a balance in life. We have to make a payment in sweat equity if we want to reap the rewards. And network marketing is no different. Anybody that tells you it is, unfortunately, they're one of those untrained or misinformed or un, I was going to say unhygienic. Maybe they are too. I don't know where that came from. Unscrupulous people who will just say anything and do anything to make a sale. Don't let that be you and be very wary if people use that type of terminology. So what network marketing is all about? It's a simple business model based on referrals. It's a business model that allows anybody to come in and go from where they are to wherever they want to be. There's no ceiling 
on the lifestyle that, that they can create. So it's, it's for ambitious people. Network marketing is all about developing you as a leader, as a person, so you can have great skills and take them wherever you go, not just financial riches. There's many ways to be rich. Network marketing is about you moving the product to make a commission and then building a team of people that sell that product to and you can get commissions from that. It's all about the movement of that product and service. Network marketing is about making the right decision. It's about being one of the ethical people, picking a good company, a good product, good people, and doing things the right way, getting education, and even no matter how desperate you are, not contributing to those negativity, the scam stories, and having a balanced view so that you know that when you're in the right direction with the right people, you're on the right track, and if you're going down the rabbit hole of looking at negativity, we can bring ourselves to center and be completely reliant on a balanced view of what we're looking for and looking at. Hopefully that was helpful. I gave you my personal view there. Hopefully you found that useful. Feel free to share it with your prospects or your team. I hope this has helped you too. If you are a network marketer and you would like to get better results, I can teach you the tactics that I use to go from 328 no's in a row to sponsoring over 750 people. I average 30 to 45 a month, became the number one international income earner in that company. I'd love to lay that out for you. I can't guarantee results, but I can guarantee you that that's the exact techniques that I use for me to get those results. It's at www.authoritynetworker.com forward slash webinar. It's also in the description area underneath this training. As I always say, go create a day in a life that counts. Always have more desires and excuses. If you're a subscriber, I'll catch you on the next one. Have a great day and bye for now.